got a weekend? Yeah. Oh, there you go. You're right there. back for now. You sure? You want them? Nah. Not yet. Oh, that's a cocktail right there, buddy. That's a that's a that's a good one. <laughs> Cuz that's what I want to go for. <laughs> I thought that was bigger than that. Don't laugh. You said that before. What's up everyone? And thanks for watching. Today, my dad and I are fishing for snappers. It's something that we've done since my brother and I were toddlers. Now I know that most people use snapper poppers and cast masters when fishing for snappers. Today we're going to show you another technique that is very fun. We're using small freshwater poppers that are intended to catch largemouth bass. You'll be surprised at how well this actually works. Oh. Whoa, he cut you off? Yeah, can you catch that for me? You really can. Why don't you use the net? Although I did land an 8 pound here on 6 pound mount. Woo! That's a nice fish. It took me all the way out to the sailboat and I was almost smooth because I saw a fin. Exactly. Nice. And I was standing right on that corner trying not to get spooled. Then finally, like, I gotta turn him down. He's gotta come. Wow. That was Bobby. Yeah. That was Bobby. Bobby come down. Alright. Okay. You're getting a lot of blowers. I'm gonna go pick popper. Back to pick popper. Like, no. Yeah, I know. I was gonna do that too. <laughs> you observe something? Yeah. Don't be up on the bed. Yeah, it was Bobby. Turn it down. Good. <laughs> Thank you. As you heard my dad say, we crimped the barbs down on our hooks. Uh, the fish are much easier to unhook that way and it causes a lot less damage yeah. to the fish. <laughs> as far as the retrieve goes, I've just given it a few pops and then I'm pausing it for like a second. Got a little happy corner over there now. <laughs> Yep. 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Did you lose my lure? I know. You gotta go to dicks, buddy. Man, you got this from China. <laughs> no, I didn't. <laughs> no, I didn't. No, I Bait, you couldn't take it anymore, huh? No. <laughs> <laughs> I got it right there. Hmm? You see right there? You have an No, a little further out. Damn, what was that? <laughs> Let's see if I can get something on this rattle trap. <laughs> It wasn't even floating, it was subsurface and he hit it. <laughs> they want, man. That's what they want this time. <laughs> I wasn't doing it on purpose. <laughs> So I noticed that the faster I started retrieving it, the more bites I started to get. You always have to pay attention to what the fish want. You drop it? <laughs> yeah, right here. <laughs> Up. I know. That's a decent swirl. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> so I decided to switch it up here. I'm going with a P-line spoon with a single hook on the back. Just cast it out and reel it in. Family, man. How's everybody? All right. Yep. <laughs> he did that. <laughs> yeah. Chad. <laughs> Me too, man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> That's a nice one. Yeah. That's a good one. Decent. Yeah, it's a better one today, yeah, I think. Yep. Back in the game. <laughs> yeah, it took a while. It's downtown. Weak fish. We're casting so far out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. One way Keep it, but. Snapper actually. Huh? So that one was a snapper. It was? <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
So the next time you go snapper fishing, go ahead and try that freshwater popper technique. I guarantee you, you will not be disappointed. Let me know how you do down in the comments below. If you enjoy the content, please hit that subscribe button if you don't mind. Thank you all for watching, and we'll catch you on the next one. I got it down now. Right? Mm-hmm.